everyone welcome back to another episode of how logical in today's video i'm going to guide you through how to change your itunes account's password keep watching the video till the end to learn how and subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button press the notification bell icon so that you'll never miss another update from us click open your itunes application and as soon as you do that go to the account button at the top left corner and click it on from the expanded menu, click on sign in and you will be taken to the sign in area of iTunes Store. Now enter your Apple ID and the password associated with your account, if you remember, your credentials. After typing the correct credentials, you'll be able to sign into your account by clicking on the sign in button. But if you'd like to change your password, you can click on forgot Apple ID or password link right below and you'll be taken to the account recovery page. Enter your Apple ID in the text box. Once you do that, click continue and enter your phone number that is displayed on the screen. Once again, click continue. If you have access to your phone number, you can now enter the verification code that has been sent to your mobile number. Enter the code in the text box and click continue. After you type in your code, you'll need to go ahead and enter the code that has been sent to your email address. Simply go click open the email and you'll be able to see a verification code sent to your email. Copy the code and paste it in the text boxes. After you're done, click continue. Now, choose a new password for your Apple ID. Type in the new password that you'd like to change to and then confirm the new password by typing it again. Make sure that your passwords meet these criteria mentioned on the display. Now, after you're done, click continue and you'll be able to change your password. Go back to your iTunes and enter the new password that you just changed to. Click on sign in and with this, you'll be able to change your password for your iTunes. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If you did, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll soon be back with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till then.